Uh, welcome to Weston Academy, or as the game likes to call it, Weston High, or like the folder likes to call it, Copy of ABDL School. This is a fetish game by, I believe, CS Fox. Actually, let me just open this, I'm sorry. Uh, oh, that doesn't look good. Current update. What? Whatever. Yeah, Weston Academy by CX, CS Fox, it came from Fox Tales Times! A strange website, excuse me, I just have to move the mic. A couple times for it to get out of my way. Um, Fox Tales Times is a nifty website. Excuse me while I turn down the fucking music. Ugh. Ooh, whoops! I thought it was gonna bring me to a thingy. Fuck day one. Oh, we're just gonna sit there. Fox Tales Times is a furry infantilist website. Furries, as most people should know, are people who like to be kind of like uh, anthropomorphic animals. They usually have an interest in it. Um, it's more of just a fantasy life or anything like that, usually it might update to something else, I don't know, go crazy. Um, very often it ends up borderline crossing into plushophilia, but that is not required, or whatever it's called. Continuing, infantilism is a weird one, it's diapers, but infantilism is a very, very, very strange fetish. This is a fetish that I've already done fanfictions on. It can go anywhere, because it ranges from just wearing diapers to using them to acting like an all-out baby and everything else in between infantilism can go anywhere in any fetish so often they can show up just about wherever the fuck they want anyways this game uh which i have no idea what the hell to expect considering the fact that i've got diapers adult babies furries and just about any other fetish under the sun because foxtails times was a website for these people to go back in 10 years ago or some shit, maybe even 12 now, uh, to not get um, antagonized by people due to, I believe, was it the CSI? It was CSI and something else. Actually, I think it was CSI of both ones. They had episodes, one having furries, another one having phantoms, but really, really stereotyped ones, and everything got messed up. Now, I'm going to be doing these videos in 15-minute pulses, because I've been noticing that Cam Studio really doesn't like it when I go over a certain limit. I used to be able to do this before. I, I have a one-hour video somewhere on my computer, but that was on an XP, and this is on Windows 7, so that probably is what changes things. Anyways, we're going to play the game, as we already did. <laughs> Day one, as we've been reading probably five million times. I will adjust the audio to taste. Snorp! Today's story begins at Weston Academy. It's a boarding school in Va that happens to have a very special development center. Knock. Come in! With my weird out blue outline and. Morning, Claire. I've got a box behind me that's blue. Good morning, Sarah. What brings you to my neck of the woods? We have a new student who's been sent to our part of the campus. This music. He's just outside the door. Well, send him in. Oh, and Claire, he's heard a rumor. He doesn't know what sure what our sender is really about. I'm not sure if that's actually what the text says. Let's just roll with it. I love Lindsay. She's getting these students in here, and they don't have a clue what to expect. Isn't that a bad thing? <laughs> yeah, but shh, come in, Alan. What's with the sh- Oh man, my pants are one color. Why, hello, Alan. Hello. Welcome to Weston Academy. This will be our new home for the rest of the school year. My name is Claire, but you can call me Miss Hunter. I'm the Weston Academy Center mother. Mother? Well, Alan, <laughs> same for us. I take special care of students sent to Weston Acad Academy Center. All the students here are my children. Not literally, but enough so that I can say I'm Center Mother. Uh-huh. Well, we'll get... <laughs> creepy! <laughs> that creepy Claire... Uh... Well, we'll get you moving. Sarah here will take you to your dorm and get you settled. I'll see you at the end of the day for supper. Well, she's a busy lady, Alan, so come on, let's get on our way. Fade screen. Fade in screen. This is your... What the f... War... This is your cabin, your new home. Your roommates are already in class. You'll meet them for afternoon class. I wonder who my roommates are. It's almost afternoon nap time. <laughs> ah, fuck you, this is diapers everywhere. Um, nap time? Yes, nap time. It's tradition that on your first day here, you take a nap promptly at 1.30 p.m. Don't you think I'm a little old for nap time? 
Older kids than you nap here, and don't talk back to me, because obviously saying OW is talking back to people. Talking back to any adult adults here warrants punishments. Whatever. But since you didn't know, this time is your fir is your warning. This first this first time is your warning. Because they're so strict that they're assholes. Sorry, I have a drink. But it's empty. We'll get you ready for your nap then. Guess I have to take a nap. Hey, what's that in the corner? Well, what is it in the corner? I wonder. Well, before we actually do anything here, I'm gonna put a save here. In case we have to go back. I don't know. I saved, right? Good. Alright, so what is that in the corner? Mats. It's a washing bowl and a wash rag. What is wrong with the soundtrack? It's like MIDI hell! It's a bunch of baby things. Diapers, baby bottles. Why is this stuff here? Are some of my roommates really that young? It's a fireplace. It's locked. It's locked! <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Nuts to you, I'm gonna... Your bed? That's your bed in the middle. Your clothes are in the dresser behind me. Amy's bed is on your right and Lance is on your left. I'm in the next room. I know you just went, but if you need to use the bathroom, it's in my room. But I think you'll be fine till after your nap now. I swear. If you need anything, I, can, I hope there's no gimmicks. I can hear through, uh, through these walls pretty well, so no worries. I will always be listening to you masturbate to this game. How old are Amy and Lance? Amy is 12 and Lance is 16. Why do you ask? Uh, no reasons. Now for your first half is important to go over the rules. Rules? Yes, rules. Now don't laugh, but a whole lot of students here have bedwetting problems. Is that why there are diapers in the corner back there? Hey, did that actually, like, into the right thing actually work? Like, was that a state transition? I gotta test that. Do you have a problem with wetting the bed? Well, I guess I'll base Alan around myself this time. Because obviously these are multiple paths. Well, I never wet the motherfucking bed. That is totally true. Well, Arch, yes. Okay, well, your bed is covered with a plastic sheet. Anyways, is that one of the rules? Yes. The other big rule concerns actually wetting the bed. Now, if you wet the bed after you said you don't, then I'll assume you've been lying to me. Well... <laughs> Well, since you said you don't wet the bed, you shouldn't need any of my help. Have a good nap. Just remember the rule. Wait, when's nap time over? 3 p.m. I'll come with your PJs are in the dresser behind you. You can change if you want. Anyways, have a nice nap. Ah, I moved. What? What? No, come back here. You totally just shoved me out of the way, you little fuck. I couldn't move. That sucks. Anyways, this soundtrack is driving my brain nuts. Give me a second while we quit and... S yes, I really want to quit. I really want to destroy my entire, like, save file here and destroy this whole game. If I talk directly to her, what happens? Wow, that's a lot fucking faster. I'll remember not to look in the corner. When's nap time over? Nuts to you. Nuts to you! Give me control over myself so I can punch you in the ass! Meh. Alright, fine. What are my pajamas, anyways? Fucking retarded. Can I switch back, please? Damn it! Wow. What the fuck is that? Like, seriously, no, look- Look over there, I look like I've got, like, a block ass. It's- <laughs> It's like a fucking trapezoid. In one color. Wow. <laughs> my hair has more detail than my clothes. Oh, fuck that crap. And whatever, nuts to you. Would you like to nap now? Nap time. Oh man, we're almost done with this video. <laughs> <laughs> the fucking audio got cut. Oh, it looks like I didn't wet the bed. I'm just gonna hide in my sheets forever. Sleep well? Yeah, I slept pretty good. <laughs> oh man, just wake that shit up. I'm here. As a reward. <laughs> Stop being so antagonistic, you motherfuckers. <laughs> for, for the day? For wetting the bed, you gotta wear diapers for the day? 
Where's this brain logic? Nuts to you, man. Fuck, fuck your... Nah, I can totally get in your way. No, fuck. But What? What? She disappeared. What? What did she say? I accidentally spoke what? Okay, she just deleted herself or I killed her. Uh, you know what? Fuck this. I'm going on my terrible, terrible, terrible quality pajamas. Fine then. I will go in my quality clothes. It's also one solid quiller. What? Seriously? Seriously? MS Paint. MS Paint could fix this. Do you not know how to shade? Does, is, doesn't this game come with tons of, like, text... Whatever, fuck this. I'm going out the door. Fade out. Fade in. Hi there, Mom! <laughs> Alright, let's get your, <laughs> your way. No, wait, I wanted to inspect the room! <laughs> fuck. Why is it I can move faster in cutscenes? <laughs> now stick close, it's a big campus. Why, I bet it is. Spencerius made an RPG maker. Fuck that crap. This is the far northeast side of the campus. As you know, it's a, it's separate from the rest of Weston Academy. So where the hell are we? What is this, diaper land? This is the diaper school of some fuck? I don't know. Oh god, cutscene. Why, hello, Jessica. Where are you off to? Hi, Sarah. I'm off to the door. I have, well, something I need help with. Something you need help with. You mean your diapers? Blush is deep red and looks really embarrassed. I don't know what you're talking about. Sure you don't. Well, anyways, before you go, I'd like you to meet Alan. Oh, hi, Alan. I'm Jessica. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you! Notice them lingering a little too long on their looks. All right, we have to get moving. Bye, Jessica. See you. You'll see Alan la again later. I hope so. Nice to meet you again, Alan. That big fucking cyan background looks like crap, by the way. She's in diapers. I wonder how many other students are. Let's get moving! Let's get this shit moving. Ugh, this is not moving. We need to haul everything. Oh, don't fucking stop. Well, this is Henderson Hall. It houses your classrooms and the library. Just about time for class now. Can I please... <sighs> I have to work in the changing room right now, so I'll walk you to class. Doop do doop 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 do do doop doop do do doop doop do doop do 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 doop do doop do 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 doop ba doop 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 This is the bathroom besides the main hall there are bathrooms back in your dorm and also in the dining hall in the chapel. There's a chapel? What? So you don't have an accident. Oh great, don't tell me this is a gimmick. Fuck that man. Again. Slowly oneself. I'll be working right here till the end of classes. This is the changing room! Students at Weston Academy area are in need of a change or have had an accident? Report here. Do you always run the tanning room? <laughs> alright, alright. Man, so how many chans do you host? I know you probably host 2 chan, 4 chan, but do you also hold. I don't know. Gura chan, Omu chan. Shit like that? Crazy, crazy motherfuckers? Any other chance? Fuck that crap. This joke is no lame. Nope! The teachers take turns and run the changing room. I'm usually here in the morning and before the afternoon classes. Oh, and where's my class? Right behind you, silly! Your teacher is Miss Eve. She teaches all the younger classmen. Oh, okay. Actually, you still have a bit of time. You could explore the building a little more. If you want. A little. That's a weird... Nah. I'll be right here should you need anything. It's like... Babyish talk in the middle of nowhere. Hey, people! <laughs> What's your animation? I love my long, luscious hair. I'm studying, leave me alone. Why? Why, hello there, Nehru! You even have all the colors. I'm Lance! Hi, Lance, I'm your roommate, Alan. I have a constant frown on my face. Oh, hey! Wow, so new roomie, huh? Yup. Well, it'll be nice to have another guy in the room. Let me know if you need anything. Cool, thanks. What's up with your hair? New guy, huh? Your hair does not match. I'm um, Justin. You'd be smart to remember that, punk. Motherfuck. Oh, wait. What happens if we talk to everybody's side? Uh, same crap. Oops. I wonder if anybody has to stop poking me. Oh, wait. I'll be around. It's the upper class. It's studying hour right now. You should probably get to class. Fuck you. I'm studying. You love your hair. Can I read your notes? Can I read your piles upon piles of books that actually look like bows? Nope. Oh, 
You're weird looking. I don't think you're in my class. I miss Bretsk, and I'm teacher of the upperclassmen here. Go run along to your class. Lesson in detail, by the way. This woman here? Yeah, she's got shading. Your hair has shading. Your character here has shading. Oh god. Well, yeah, why not? Thank you, game. Oops. Boop. Everybody else has shading. Hey, you're the new guy! Come over and meet everyone. Oh man, we're almost done with this. Hi, I'm Evelyn. I'm Jamie. Matt. And I'm Amy! Oh, you're Amy? I'm living in your new dorm now. My name's Alan. Oh, really? Nods. Shrieks happily. I have two big brothers now. Nice to meet you, Alan. You like to excuse Amy? Her talking is, like, complete shit. She can get a bit excited about stuff like this, too. Sticks her tongue out at Matt. She's also super juvenile. What, what's her age again? Why the fuck is she hanging around like everybody else? So, Alan, what are you in for? Excuse me? In for what? Forgive Jamie. She's a bit blunt now sometimes. She just wants to know why you're here. I'm not really sure why. They just called me to report to this side of the campus this morning. That's a new one. Really? Why? Well, everyone here is here for reasons. Meekly raises his hand, wetting the bed. That's why they sent me here. Blushes, same for me. A few moments pass while this sinks in. Hmm, Sarah asked me about wetting the bed, but I didn't... Don't have a problem with it. No problems here either. They just thought I was unsociable and sent me here, because that makes a lot of fucking sense. You unsociable? No. At least I'm not in diapers like some people. <coughs> Evelyn. Blushes deep red. That was uncalled for, Jamie. Not like it's a big secret. Sniffing a little. Well, Alan didn't know. Oh, man, the super oversensitive crappy characters. Yay. Diapers, what is this? <laughs> well, what would, my, what would be my real reaction in real life? Eh. Still, really? You don't think it's weird? Nah. There's worse. It's not... Yes. <laughs> Nobody can say no here. Ah, <laughs> oh, sorry. Something you should... You're being a bitch. <laughs> the teacher's over here with her, like, emo hair. Take your sheets. Alright. I think I'm gonna stop here because the screen's gone black for the last time. And I'm fucking sick of this blackness. Alright, join us when we figure out what's, like, I don't know, this shit's all about. You know? So, Kai 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 9. Let's go to school.